Hey everybody, it's Dan French, and I'm just giving you a quick update on the mortgage interest rates and what's going on from yesterday's reports. You know, we looked at what could impact rates. You know, we talked about the labor report. It did come out better than expected, so they didn't have a good impact on rates. The stock market recovered, and so we did see a little bit of an uptick. And um, just on rates, you know, the bonds, bond prices actually uh, went down, which means the yield on the rate for that bond, which is the um, Fannie Mae bond for mortgage-backed securities, it went up a little bit. And so it's not alarming. It's just, you know, we're volatile. Overall, though, we're in a really good position. We're still four and a half uh, to 4.75% on most 30-year fixed products. And uh, I, can, I continue to see this happening. I'm looking at refinances right now thinking it's a golden opportunity for anybody out there that maybe was pushed out because rates were not doing as good and you know now they're back in the market they're back looking and seeing what the savings are uh, they're also people that are looking to cash out refinance you know this is a good time to do it too because maybe the payment was too high at the time and now you can pull that equity out and do what you want with it this year and so we've started off the year good uh, I do think this is going to continue to happen I do think rates will still continue to go up, but we're we're really seeing a nice correction on rates. And it's, I had a lot of people last year telling me, you know, the market's going to collapse and the rates are going to, you know, keep going up, and it's just going to be uh, we can't buy a home. And look, it's always something to consider. You know, our our, our home's going to be too high for people to afford the payment on them. Um, you know, keeping rates this low, it's still, you know, I think it's still keeping people in the market. And I think any time that something comes up where mark, you know, rates change or something changes, it does put a hint of caution and everybody goes back on sitting on the sidelines. So, look, I'll keep you informed of what's going on. You guys can make the decision best for wherever, wherever you're at in life, what your goals are. Uh, but I'll continue to, you know, help you guys and, and hopefully give you some insight and good direction on what to do. Right now, I'm telling everybody, even though we had pricing go up yesterday, I'm still taking a quick, look, you know, a real close look at this. I'm still floating on in some cases on some of my my deals, just because I want to see what's happening with the market come Monday and Tuesday. Um, you know, like I said, relatively though, right now refinances and purchases, it's a great time to buy, just because rates have corrected themselves a little bit and come down a little bit. I would say it's, you know, the market has uh, corrected itself a little bit too on homes, purchase of homes too, you know, some of the sellers out there, they're now seeing that these offers aren't getting accepted, so they're lowering their purchase price uh, to what, what it should be. So if you have any questions, contact me back, 702-332-3532. Uh, as always, look forward to working with anybody out there. If you have any friends or family, please refer my name. Dan French, we'll talk to you soon.